Hey you guys, it's me Kiana coming at you again today. Um, this is going to be short and sweet because this is just an idea I want to throw out there. But I've been thinking about it for about a month and a half. Um, I haven't seen anybody do this on YouTube, but um, I truly look at my subscribers as um, family. And that's why every time somebody subscribes and I actually um, am notified that you guys subscribe to me and I, it's drawn to my attention, it's brought to my attention. Um, I actually formally go take my girls with me, so to speak, and we go knock on your channel door and formally welcome you into the family. Um, and if you do subscribe, uh, and because I don't get notification like some people do get, um, if you do subscribe and I notice that I do this, but please, if you subscribe, um, leave me a comment so that I know that you are there, um, and then we can grow, have a rapport with each other. But anyway, I um. You can be selective on who you choose to be subscribers, but that's why I like my cold snack group. And although we're pushing a thousand subscribers, I like the ones I have. Um, now I, I welcome any any extras, but it's really a family-like unit because we cry one minute, we laugh one minute, we pray one minute, um, we disagree one minute, but at the end of the day, we family and we love each other. You understand what I'm saying? And it may sound strange to some people, but um, I actually have grown uh, grown to have a bond with um, my subbies. So, um, I think that's one of y'all now. I'm going to have to call you back. I know you're probably listening, but I'm going to have to call you back. It's one of my, um, um, it's one of my subby families now. Um, but yeah, so it's just that um, we, as women, I want us to, um, to have a sisterhood, you know, and I talk about that a lot, and, yeah, we talk about people, we laugh, and all that kind of stuff, but at the end of the day, like I said, we family, dysfunctional and all, we still family, they don't like what each other say, but we still family, you understand what I'm saying, and I like that about us, and, um, I really value that and cherish that. Now, with that being said, I was thinking about something, you guys. I was thinking about us having a little trip. Now, I was thinking about doing this. That's why I'm running the past y'all now so we can, A, get the ideas together, and B, um, um, I'll throw out some suggestions of how it'd be financially, we'll be financially able to do it, and C, we can figure out what we're actually going to do and where we're going to go or whatever. You know, all of us are all over the world, basically. So, what we would do is probably um, meet at one location. At, you know what I'm saying? The people that want to do this. I'm coming from Maryland, but of course, I'm, you know, I'm willing to go basically all the way if I got to go to California or whatever. But, um, I thought it'd be nice for us to have, like, a girls weekend and... Like a lot of us get together, a lot of us from YouTube get together and have a girls weekend. Like maybe we can get like a really nice suite. And y'all know if we willing to and just get some air beds and all kinds of stuff. Because see, I ain't trying to do a bougie. You know what I'm saying? I'm not even trying to do it. We can get a suite. We can put, uh, buy some food stamps for some people and bring some stuff. Y'all know I'm going to keep it real for real. Okay? We can be cooking and all kinds of stuff that weekend. Go, then we can all get dolled up. Do each other makeup and stuff like that. Put our lace fronts on. You know what I'm saying? You got some, you got some um, glute tabs. Okay, for real. You know what I mean? So I thought it'd be nice for us to uh, maybe plan a trip around tax time, and um, it probably won't cost us a whole bunch because a lot of us can drive. Like for instance, I drive, and actually, um, I can actually get. Um, like map it out like we got so much time now if we start planning little things we got so much time now that we can actually map it out and y'all know I have two 15 passenger vans so I can actually on the way map it out where I could pick up some people too you see what I'm saying so it'll be economical for all of us and it won't cost us a whole pile of money you see what I'm saying let Chuck drop us, drop us off and come back and get us and we do the same thing coming back 
then the people that live close, you know what I'm saying, they could do the same thing on on the other side of the world. You see what I'm saying? So I just thought it'd be nice. And a lot of people ain't going to a, be able to participate in this. A lot of people ain't going to want to participate in this. Um, a lot of people can't participate in this. But out of all these, you know, subscribers and stuff, not including y'all channel that have subscribers, if y'all pass it along and you want to, you know what I'm saying? But I just want it to be mainly the subscribers that I have um, since I'm coming up with the idea. Now, if you have any subscribers that want to come over to the channel, whatever, we get to know them, that's fine. But I have a rapport with literally almost every subscriber that I have. And you all know that I give y'all nicknames and all kinds of stuff. That's not the brag and say I'm real personable or anything like that. It's just that I really care about the people who's taking time out of their lives to actually look for me every day, tune into me every day, give me advice, and love me through anything I'm going through. So, y'all got skewed because y'all know I got this real bad cold that Chuck didn't gave me. Guess what he came home with yesterday, y'all? Uh-huh. We ain't even gonna go there. Brother came home with a camcord so I could start taking videos with y'all with me. Wanna go. So when we going into like these stores and stuff and I find these deals, who gonna whip out the camera? Me. Who gonna whip out the camera for Black Friday? Me. Okay. And what I'm gonna start doing is before I go to a store the night before, I think it's a good idea that I tell y'all where I'm gonna go and I can get requests of what y'all wanna see. Like if somebody need somebody um PM me today and told me that they was looking for baby clothes, dirt cheap. And I told them what store to go into. So if they was to know I was going to a certain store, say if I was going to example, Old Navy, I would give y'all Heads up, I'm going to Old Navy tomorrow, y'all. Y'all would send me on that video. Um, can you see how much their uh, plus-size jeans are? Or can you see if they got any hoodies on sale? And I will go there and show y'all that. So I thought that would be nice because I haven't seen nobody really doing that. And um, besides that, then we can all save a couple of dollars. Because y'all know I'm all about that. You know what I mean? I believe that a true diva can um, have the ability to do anything and everything. And then do it while she, you know, all at the same time while she's looking fly. That's what I believe. But, um, yeah, so back to, um, the trip. I just, I don't know right now because I haven't thought about it. Um, I know a lot of people, I was thinking about a cruise, but I know a lot of people ain't, you know, not going to be able to afford that or whatever. Um, or maybe don't want to spend money on a cruise. But I've never went on a cruise and I thought that would be nice. Even if we just did, a, um, a local cruise. Also, we probably can get group rates. That's why I said we're going to just have to, like, brainstorm together. Um, I don't know how to do blog TV. I believe blog TV is where y'all can view me and I'll view y'all or whatever at the same time. I don't know. I, nobody really explained it to me, really, but I can ask Nene to give me information about it. But we probably will have to do that so we can brainstorm and get some ideas together. Um, jot down any ideas that you guys may have. Place it on this video as well. Um, if you think it's a good idea, place it on this video. Thumbs it up. If you like the idea, whatever, too. Um, I just, like I said, I just, it's a lot of cattiness and stuff going on. And we know that goes along sometimes with women. Even if we're not like that, it just goes along. It's a stereotype that women have. And sometimes we fall into that trap where uh, we fit the stereotype. But I just thought it would be a good idea, a uh, fun time for us as women, as mothers, as wives to get away without any distractions to focus on us we can even do stuff like um maybe go to a hair convention um all kinds of stuff you know um shopping trip we can as i said we got i got a lot of ideas in my head we can even go if we didn't even want to just we could actually go to a state that maybe have like a lot of outlet stores or whatever like that i just think it'll be fun for us so uh by all means um get back to me you guys I uh, wanted to throw it out there before I forgot because I've been meaning to tell y'all this in like several videos, but um, you know, I get sidetracked and stuff like that. So, uh, this is just an idea for my ladies. Um, and we'll figure out like a, a budget amount, but I like I said, I think this would be a good time around tax time. So, that's probably um, well, I'm self employed, so I don't 
had to uh, turn a W-2. So we, by law, do taxes. We can start as early as June the 4th. I mean, January the 4th. Um, that's for people that are self-employed. But, or you all had to turn in a um, W-2 form order. You all had to wait for a W-2. But uh, most of my ladies are not self-employed, so y'all got to wait for a W-2. You know, by law, in order for the company not to get a fine, um, they have until January the 31st. So, I guess we were planning around uh, March, maybe. So, like I said, we got plenty of time uh, for you ladies that are in the tax bracket where you don't get hardly anything back. Um, then... It had to give you still time to be able to jot some money away every month, say start next month, November, December, January, February, March. And if you jot a little bit away every month, then you'll have money. But I just think this would be fun to do besides, you know, being mothers, besides being wives, not including the kids, not including the hubby or nothing like that. Just focusing on us and also we'll be able to network together and all that kind of stuff. So this is just an idea. Um, let me know what y'all think. I love y'all so much. And, um, that's it. Be blessed.